My name is Brandon Sarkis on behalf of Expert Village. Today I'm going to show you how to make chicken alla cacciatore or hunter style chicken. You see our oil has a nice shimmer to it now. There's also a little bit of smoke coming off so what that means that means I need to get something there to cool it off real fast. So let's go with our uh, let's go with the breasts first. Skin side down just like that. And this is going to pop, so you're going to want to be careful. Kind of staying clear. And there's a thigh. A thigh. Okay. And it's okay if your chicken touches, it won't ruin it. But I'm going to do this in a uh, I'm going to do this in two waves. I'm going to do my uh, legs and thighs, or my thighs and uh, breasts first, and I'll do the legs and wings second. Because I don't want to overcrowd it, because you overcrowd it, and it just takes a whole lot longer for it to cook. So what we're going to do here, we're going to let this go for about, probably about four minutes, five minutes, get a little brown on it. I'm going to throw a lid on it, just so it doesn't splatter everywhere, and also to help kind of uh, really, kind of, steam and cook the chicken so and also just to keep the uh, oil from splattering all over the place on me so let's come back in about three or four minutes and see how we're looking all right so it's been two minutes this is going to be really really obnoxious yeah so we'll see we have a nice brown that's what we're looking for right there is that brown color so i'm just going to put them back over here on my chicken plate I had and like I said it, even though there was raw chicken on this plate don't worry about contamination because this chicken is going to be cooking some more it's not even fully cooked right now so it's already it, you would contaminate somebody if you serve it to them right now as it is this piece is being difficult all right so now I'm going to throw in the wings and the uh, two legs we've got Making sure we don't splatter ourselves. I turned my heat down a little bit there when I uh, when I um, went to pull this chicken out, just because I didn't want it to splatter all over the place. Even though it still did, it didn't splatter nearly as much. So let's wipe our countertop down. Let's set our timer here for three minutes. Should be about right. And uh, I guess I'm going to be back in three minutes, and we'll uh, pull out this chicken.